Hey guys, it's Randy with KC, and this is David with Premier Res Gears. Yeah, so today we're gonna upgrade this baby, right, David? Oh yeah. I mean, dude, it's been a long time coming. What are we gonna be doing today with these Revolution gears? So we're gonna be installing the 513 gears on this baby, and basically we're gonna get your eighth gear back in because right now you are not seeing it. Oh yeah, totally, dude. <laughs> like when I go up to Williams. Every single time I go, I'm just like sluggish, sluggish. I'm like downshift, <laughs> downshift. I didn't even know that there was an eighth gear at one point, but man, I'm looking forward to actually using this yeah. rig as it's supposed to be because it's like running on 37 and dude, it's four tens is just killing it. Like it's super yeah. slow. Yeah, like uh, a lot of people don't know with the rear gear, it helps a lot with the transmission, take some stress off of it. Helps you get your shift points back, your gas mileage back, all that good stuff. So, oh yeah, gotta be running a lot better. Definitely, I want to definitely try to milk as much gas yeah. as I can. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, bud. Of course, man. So what are we doing here right now? I'm removing the three bolts to get the axle out. <laughs> Be careful with the ABS sensor. We don't need to remove it. The reason we're pulling the axle out is so we can get the locker out. Because the, the axle slides into the locker itself. So we have to get both sides. So we were moving the, the bearing, one to replace it. Secondly, you have to remove the bearing to get to, uh, to install the new ring gear. You have to get, remove the actuator because it won't fit. The ring gear won't fit over all this. Yeah, so I'm really excited about this yeah. install, and I'm gonna just take this thing out to Lyle Creek, and whoa, whoa. hold on. What do you mean? There's a braking procedure. What? Yeah, so for the first 500 miles after the rear gear, you gotta brake gun. So basically, you can't exceed 60 miles per hour, and you gotta do 30 minute drive, 30 minute cool off, until you hit the 500 miles. Oh man. Yeah, so no trails, no trails Oh today. man, it looks like we're just gonna be doing freeway <laughs> for after this, but yeah. yeah, gotta break it in, right? Yeah, you gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> Step, the most important step, never forget oil in the dip. <laughs> wow, Carlos, that looks freaking amazing. Like, so what did you do, man? Because it looks brand new. So part of our process is we clean the dip cover and put a new coat of paint every time at the end of each install. We're breaking in the Revolution gear right now. I definitely see a huge difference. Um, before it used to be sluggish, not anymore. I'm actually experiencing like the eighth gear, which is like, wow. 